what is going on bf familia how are you guys doing today it's your girl crystal welcome back to my channel guys guys if you guys have not subscribed please subscribe to the channel join the family and also share the videos so that way my videos will get more and more people to come to my channel and um that like content just like this if you like scary content this, this channel is for you guys also um go follow me on all social medias um they will be in the description down below and um last but not least guys i want to let you guys know that the reason why you haven't been seeing um me post for the past two days is because um basically i uploaded two videos um the days that i was supposed to be recording so when i uploaded them um when i uploaded them um the next day they were taken down because i guess youtube has their policy and i guess they were copyrighted videos i'm not really sure but um that's the reason why um basically my videos were taken down and that's why you you guys didn't get to see for the past two days because i did upload them but then when i woke up the next day they were they were not there so i'm so sorry about that guys but i'm going to make up for that so we're going to be watching five scary un unexplained sounds you don't want to hear so we're going to get started all right guys we're going to get started here we go yes. this next clip was sent in to me by john plymel he says that he and his friend alan were checking out an abandoned farmhouse near his grandmother's home in upstate new york as you can see the house is isolated Upstate New York. It sits in the middle of nowhere on a barely traveled back road. The outside looks like something right out of a horror movie. Okay. And the inside is no better. Bro, it stinks. Of course, what is this whole small way? Look at all this garbage. He said it stinks, guys. This is an old house. Like, what do you expect it to smell like? Common sense, right? Can't open this TV, so... The house is a death trap, full of rot and mold. The upstairs floor is so rotten the two are afraid to even try to venture up the stairs. And the basement is piled with garbage. Yeah, I guess that's it. That's the basement? Yeah, that's disgusting. It's just piled with trash. The stairs don't even look connected but to each other. They hear something upstairs. You're hearing it, right? Like random footsteps? If somebody was up there, they would fall through. You can see spitting. Connect SLS infrared camera to scan for potential ghosts. Oh. 
And then this happens. I'm not sure if it's old floorboards just kind of popping as I'm walking, but I, I, I've gotten that twice now. I don't really know. And I'm getting a lot of high pitch frequency interference in here. Whoa, what the f what? was that? What? I have no. What the f <laughs> what did you hear? I don't know, dude. That was a loud scream. I don't know what that was. It's mapping somebody over there. Dude. Is, is it? It's mapping somebody over there. Dude, dude. dude I heard like a like a blood curdling girl scream. Like like it sounded like it was in the distance, but I I, I don't even. Dude, I didn't hear that. Woo. That was very very spooky. Oh. Whoa, what? That the is clear as day. Whoa, what the? They set up a camera to film in a large room that is one of the oldest parts of the Donovan Mill. We leave the night vision camera recording in this room all night, and about 45 minutes after we leave, we catch something unbelievable. So I found this website. Oh, it was really so good about the commercial. AFC, and I... strange about this figure is that it appears to be moving in slow motion. Here's the same clip played three times in fast forward so you can get a better idea of what the movement would look like in real time. Later on, the guys use a weird little device called an obelisk, which supposedly allows ghosts to manipulate electromagnetic fields to produce words from an internal dictionary. But they get more than just a few random words. Use whatever energy you need. Before time. Before time? Why did that say two, two words? words? Yeah, it's two whole words on there. Oh, no. Bro, that said it weird, too. Yeah, it like drug, drug it. Oh my god. What the? F that was Dude, a no, that was not me. Dude, oh my god, I got chills up to my... Dude, I got chills all the way up to like... That wasn't you? That was not me, dude. Oh, no. Bro, that said it weird, too. Yeah, it like dragged the dragon. Oh my god. What the... That was dude, it. no, that was not me. What's unbelievable about this chair moving is if you watch my body and the table, they're both completely still up until when the chair hits the opposite side of the table. So there's no way that I would have accidentally nudged it or kicked it or anything like that because you would have seen both of those move. Did the haunted side team catch a screaming ghost on camera? What do you think? By the way, you can check out this entire video as well as the Haunted Side's other investigations over on their YouTube channel. The Lady in the Water Over the last week, this next clip has gone viral in the country of Saudi Arabia, even appearing on the nightly news. So the story goes that the townspeople of Jazan, Saudi Arabia begin to hear strange sounds coming from a long-abandoned water tank. When they gathered at the tank to investigate, things just got stranger. The townspeople called local authorities, but by the time they arrived, the screaming had stopped. They investigated, but there was absolutely no one inside the tank. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Eight hundred feet down. 
Over on the YouTube channel, Exploring Abandoned Mines, a guy named Frank and his team explore some crazy, out-of-the-way caves and mines. In this video, his team member Gabe agrees to be lowered into a 550-foot deep mine shaft in Mexico. Now, if you're even no. slightly claustrophobic or have a fear of heights, this alone like is guys. pure That's one of my nightmare fears. fear. I'm going down a mine shaft right now. I'm going to be going down in 600 feet. Yeah, it's scary, I'll admit that. It ain't scary, it's not. That's so fast. Oh, man. And it gets even scarier when the rope gets tangled and Gabe is just left dangling halfway down. Mm -hmm. We're just, we're just sort out some knots and they're like uh, twists in the round. I don't want to sit here too long. My imagination will go crazy. <laughs> well, let's just look around a little bit. Ooh. It's just super scary. Look how far down it goes. Well, well, I should probably change my mind right about now. 300 feet, that's but really... the creepiness doesn't stop there. At around 300 feet down in the mine shaft, Gabe hears something. Oh my god. Scrap some rocks to drop. You down there? I just what was that? Something. First, it almost sounds like a quiet little voice says, Oh, then there's a bizarre hissing sound. Oh, what was that? There's been rampant speculation in the YouTube comments as to what the strange sounds might be. Everything from animals and creatures to simple rope noise. But what do you think? You can check out the entire two-part series of the 550-foot descent into the mine over on the YouTube channel, Exploring Abandoned Mines. The Creatures of the Night. So in this video recorded in East Texas, the uploader claims that there are some strange sounds going on outside his home. Well, we were sitting around, hanging out, watching TV, and cats were laying right here at my feet. Next thing you know, they get up, take off running, and tails popped out, so heard something they didn't like. Been some strange sounds. Heard a few bangs on the house, so they heard something they didn't, something they didn't like, so I said, check it out. What's going on? He dismisses the sound as simply being the howls and yips of faraway coyotes. Mm -hmm. But then the sound gets closer and doesn't seem so much like coyotes anymore. Okay. I would have went back in my house. Mm -hmm. So did this guy capture the sound of strange bee 
face howling and screaming into the night? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. Alright guys, we are at the end of this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Comment down below what you guys think. Let me know if you guys want video suggestions. Let's get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of 2023. We are going to be doing a big giveaway once we get to 1,000 guys. So you guys have to share the videos. And also you guys have to comment and like the videos. Also guys, I do have some good news. Um, some Yeah, some good news. I'm thinking about opening up another channel. Just a family channel. So since this one is due to like reaction videos, this one's gonna stay like that, but I'm thinking about doing a family channel. Um, let me know what you guys think of that suggestion and let me know. And um, we'll definitely be getting stuff like that started. So we're gonna be doing a lot of family things on that channel, like vlogs, um, challenges, um, sometimes pranks here and there. Um, just doing like family stuff, like. Like, if we go out somewhere, like a vlog or something, something fun. But yes, um, let me know what you guys think of that suggestion and let me know down in the comments if you guys want me to do that. And no further ado, it's your girl Crystal and I'm signing out.